Hey YouTube, this is Amy G Fun72. Uh sorry I haven't done a video in a while. I've been um, kind of busy. Yeah, I'll stick with that. Uh so yeah, today I have the green or olive green olive drab Haza. Um he is a really cool figure because overall I just like the haze up and his color. Let me see the color. I got a new light. So, I'm gonna shine it on him. Yeah, you see his color? It's all nice and stuff. He comes with an assault rifle, the pineapple frag grenades, or, yeah, and then the medical pouch thing. They say that that's removable, but. Yeah, they say that that's removable, but I can't get it off. I don't want to. Try to apply it off with like pliers or something. But yeah, so this guy has 26 points of articulation. I think. <laughs> yeah, um. He has removable helmet. Sorry if the camera won't show it because this is a widescreen camera, so the top is cut off a little bit. I'm just gonna take out my salt rifle. So yeah. Got a removable helmet. I don't want to yank that off though because it's kind of hard. Oh, and it's hard to put back on. Removable short shoulder pads. And where's the hole? There it is. And removable chest piece. There we go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, it's a good action figure. I haven't had any problems with it. Except this joint right here. It seems to be extended a little, like, if you look inside, you can see there's a gap right there. I don't think that, you know, it's not on the other side. Oh, yeah, that's the only problem. It's not severe or anything. Peg holes. He has, I'm not really sure if that's a peg hole. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's for, like, the grenades for what Emil has. This is Emil. Yeah, those. Also, Noble 7 has those. Yeah, so he's got a, that thing, that hole there. Uh, he doesn't have any tactical attachments on this arm. I just want to point that out. Because I remember that. Um, there's a peg hole underneath this. That's what's holding on the pouch. A peg hole right here. And then the little extended pegs. Oh, and then the peg hole on the back. The detail um, is, I want to say pretty, and also want to say really good. There's not that much battle damage, just a little bit on the helmet. Focus camera, I demand it. Um, there's a tiny bit, you can see the, on the top right here, a little bit of scratches. But that's about it. Oh, but the knees and like the legs have a lot of damage on them. So, yeah, uh, all the joints work. They're nice and smooth, not too loose, not too tight. Just right. Like from, I believe it's called Goldilocks. I recently learned about Goldilocks. Apparently, it's some type of child story. I guess I should have known about that a while ago, but I didn't. Hmm. Um, so, yeah, this is a nice figure, and I recommend getting him. He's good quality, good price. Well, it's the same price as all the other figures, except on ToysRus.com, Tartarus, they still have him. He's seven ninety eight, I think, because they want to get rid of him. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it. So, comment, like, don't dislike, because remember, it makes me cry, and then when I cry, I'm sad. I'm not sad when I cry, I cry when I'm sad. Or, no, I, I messed that up. But, <laughs> yeah. So if you don't, if you really hate these reviews, you guess you can dislike them. But also, I'd tell me what you hate, or I'd like it if you tell me what you hate, so I can fix it. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go through the whole spiel again. Like, and if you absolutely hate it, dislike, and if you want to subscribe.